Welcome to MTM, I'm Steve Swarangen. Today we're gonna to show you how to operate a trailer. What I wanna do is you're gonna look either through your mirrors or if you have a rear window in your day cab semi, we will have you look through the back window and make sure that your fifth wheel is lined up with a kingpin in the back of the truck and the trailer. As soon as you're sure that they are aligned, you'll go ahead and back under the trailer. Once you're underneath the trailer and you hear that couple, you're gonna put it back in first gear and you're gonna try and pull forward. If it's locked, the trailer should drag with you and kind of bounce and jump. So next we're gonna get out of the truck and we're gonna walk back to the catwalk. So here we have your service brake line, your emergency brake line, your seven pin connector for your lights. And this is the universal glad hand that runs your tailgate latches, your air high lift and your bag dump switch. We'll start off by hooking up your service brake. Then we'll do our emergency brake. Then our seven pin connector for our lights. And now our universal glad hand for the tailgate and latches. Then we'll move on to your hydraulic hose. You bring this over here to your hydraulic fitting on the back of the frame. Remove your plug and you stick the wing nut on here and you make sure it's on straight and then you'll tighten the wing nut until it stops. So our next step will be to turn on our lights to the trailer and your truck. We'll reach over here and you'll pull your hazards. Now we'll climb out of the truck and go back and check the lights on the trailer. So first you're going to check your driver's side front and side light. We'll go back here to your side light. Your red side marker should be on. You have a single turn signal in here and a single red penny light up at the top to make sure that it's also working. And since we have our flashers on, you're gonna see your light here on the triangle is actually gonna be flashing along with your turn signals underneath the trailer. We're gonna make sure this flasher is working, make sure our penny light's on and make sure our side clearance light's good. We'll walk up here to the front of the trailer and we'll check our right front corner lenses and make sure our lights are on here. So next we're gonna get under the trailer here and we're gonna pull the pins out of the step legs and raise your step legs and lock them in place. All trailers must have two forms of latches just for safety reasons. So if you haul any kind of slurry or any kind of extra heavy loads, this is an extra precaution to make sure that this tailgate stays sealed in the, in the case that your latches do quit working while driving the trailer. This trailer is actually equipped with a hydraulic high lift tailgate, which runs off of your main cylinder in the front of the trailer. This one is actually plumbed underneath. The trailer runs actually up to the front to your main cylinder where it has a shut off for the cylinder and for your high lift cylinder. In this position, your high lift cylinders will open as soon as you start to lift your trailer. If we want to shut them off and keep it as a uh, regular swing tailgate, we'll pull this towards the truck and this shuts off the hydraulic pressure to the tailgate. Leaving this to lift and run the trailer as a regular swing tailgate. If we want to clean out the trailer, we can turn this back on and we can shut the main cylinder off. You can keep your trailer down. Now you can climb into the trailer and use your high lift function and have the tailgate up while you clean your trailer out. We're gonna come back here to your bag dump and we're gonna make sure that your bag dump is in the down position so that when you dump this trailer, as soon as you pull your latches for your tailgate, your bags will drop, your tailgate will unlatch, and this is all for safety because if this trailer dumps while you are on the bags, then there is a possibility that this trailer could tip over. We're gonna go ahead and raise the trailer and raise the tailgate together as a combination so we can see how the trailer moves and works. We're gonna go ahead and release both of the brakes. And now that they're released, we're gonna wait for the trailer to build up air pressure, turn our PTO on, release the clutch. We're gonna now pull the tailgate latch switch and airbag dump as our tailgate latches are coming up and open. Our bags are dumping and we can start the movement of our trailer. 